Hello, welcome back to a OHL review. My name is Tyson and today we are going to review the Tiger and Bunny Chibi Arts Dragon Kid. Let's look at the packaging, it looks really decent and it says Dragon Kid and this product is sponsored by Tamashi Nation and Bandai Products. Let's check out the back section and you can see all the different demonstrations of Dragon Kid that you could pose and looks pretty cool and also have some Japanese writing. You can see this product has the Bandai sticker that show you this product is the real deal. Okay, let me show you what contains on this buster. Let's get to the point. Two cute faces, one dragon staff, Six extra switchable arms, one backup chips, two things that attach on the hitband, one dragon base, and some Japanese catchphrase, and that's all my friends. Let me introduce you Dragon Kid. Her name is Pao Li Huang. I think I'm pronouncing it right, but if I'm not, let me know. And she is advertising for a cow bee. I think it's a Japanese food product and a Japanese website called DMM.com. So she has two major sponsors. She gear up on her costume. And the detail of this figure looks amazing. And the size about this figure is four inches tall. And I'm telling you, she looks fantastic. This is the back section that you're watching and let me show you something about this figure. You have to use the stand so you could balance your figure because I'm afraid to tell you. This figure cannot stand by itself. It needs the stand to be honest. Okay, overall this figure looks super cool, very cute. Even she's sporting dragon at her back. It looks really cool and it gives a Chinese tradition to this figure. Let's talk about the different face expression that comes with this figure. As you're seeing, this one looks really nice while displaying with the potato chips makes it look really cool because you can see she is enjoying her chips and you can pose this figure as many style as you want. Here's another one how she looks when you switch with her new pairs of arms and I'm showing this that you could pose this figure like she's having some kung fu fighting style pose and you could display all your figures with the Japanese catchphrase. In all honesty this figure is really enjoyable to own and I guarantee you that you will have so much fun having this figure as you're in your collection. If you're a fan of the Dragon Kid, you will love this one. Definitely, if you're a fan of Tiger Bunny. Here's one of my favorite poses. You could display this figure, the Dragon Kid, having some delicious steam buns, or maybe could be pork buns. I really love her face expression about this figure. Makes her look so innocent and cute. 
and I will display this figure in my Chibi Arts collection. And next time I will review in the future, maybe it's gonna be Katetsu and the Chibi Arts or other figures. Okay? Finally, last, here is one epic pose I really enjoy. You could pose her, um, the Dragon Kid holding the Dragon Staff. This figure looks totally awesome. I like her face expression, you can see she's ready to get down and fight with her opponents. You won't be disappointed in buying this figure, especially if you're a fan of the Chibi Arts line and Dragon Kid. Trust me, you will love this figure. My friends, the time is up on this review. Before I say goodbye, if you're a fan of the Chibi Arts that looks so cute for your collection, I recommend you to buy this one at the store iplamo.com. Also, I really enjoy this figure because the detail looks superb, beautiful, very cute. I'm glad I picked this up at iplamo. I give this figure 10 out of 10 for a good looking figure. The detail, you can see how adorable she looks. Oh, and you want to see more Tiger Bunny? I will do more, okay? This is Tyson, and I'll see you on the next review, and goodbye.